So thanks to Hidden Figures, a new generation of young women can really see themselves achieving excellence in STEM fields. And I've had the pleasure of talking to many young people today who are doing just that. Yeah. It's my pleasure to introduce our speaker, Margot Lee Shetterling. Thank you. To be here and at this school where the chancellor is the daughter of uh, one of the original hidden figures, that original group of African-American women who went to work in Langley um, as, as human computers um, is just really remarkable. You know, in all of this time that I've spent traveling and talking about hidden figures, another question inevitably comes up. Absolutely every single group and probably every conversation that I've had, um, it's usually the first people, question, people ask and they say, why haven't I heard this story before? Why didn't I know about this story and these women and what they did? The movie took so many broad brushstrokes and elements of the book, but the thing about the book that I just loved was digging into these details and um, you know, finding your mother's name in the, uh, the, Na the Langley Laboratory employee newsletter. Mm -hmm. And, um, you know, tracking down all of these women, where they had been to school, finding letters that their teachers had written about them, um, you know, when they were, um, you know, 16 years old yeah. and seeing pictures of them. Do you have any Sorry. advice for aspiring authors? At some point, you just have to sit down and start writing, and you have to just keep writing. Well, thank you so much, everybody, and thank you so much. Thank you.